Good morning. Today we are going to learn about curry mean fry. How to make a curry mean fry? I will make it as fast as possible so that you don't have to worry about the length of the video. These are the ingredients that I've taken for the curry mean fry masala. I've taken equal quantity of chili powder and chili flakes. This is fenugreek powder. I have taken salt, rock salt, pepper powder, turmeric powder and little bit of curry leaves. You mix it all up with little bit of water and if you want you can add little bit of one spoon of uh, vinegar also so that it will give you a tangy taste or even lime juice. We have cut the curry mean and uh, marinated them little little bit curd so that no smell comes out of it. So let's go do the marination once you mix up the marination it should have this kind of a texture because adding little bit of lime juice or even vinegar is because you need to have that uh, rock salt to be dissolved into this one main ingredient that i forgot to tell you with the masala is that ginger garlic paste you can add even from the bottle or even even you can crush it and add it to this taste okay and uh, a bit of three four button onions to be crushed also will be an added taste to the masala usually we are used to just chili powder and uh, turmeric powder and salt but i'm adding as a a little bit of extra things like pepper powder fenugreek powder and chili flakes and chili powder in equal quantity i am using this for two fishes two karmine fishes which is i'm taking one tablespoon of chili powder one tablespoon of chili flakes and half teaspoon of turmeric half teaspoon of pepper powder half teaspoon of uh, fenugreek powder salt and chili flakes everything together please mix it up and you can additionally you can add little bit of button onions crushed and main ingredient always should be ginger garlic paste so let's marinate now before you marinate you should cut the fish lengthwise like this so that the marination gets into the fish completely and also inside also like when you marinate like this make sure that it goes inside completely and 3/4 of the fish should be inside the oil so that the inside where we are putting up this masala now inside the stomach of the fish should also be crisply fried so that uh, this cuts makes them in go in uh, the marination go right deep into the flesh so that it tastes much much better this is how you should be frying the curry mean because the it should be at least 3/4 to half should be immersed in the uh, oil though none of our amichis and ammas will not allow so much of uh, oil to be used for frying but still the best part of our arap is being put in and fried again in the oil so remove them while the fish is frying so that this doesn't get burned 